So AJ, how, um, you know, training camp's over, don't have a game this week, but uh, uh, how's everything been coming together for the uh, defensive year? Everything been going smooth, uh, just ready to go now, you know, went through training camp, all the preseason games, and uh, just getting ready to go next week. How much you've actually gone against Bernhardt? Uh, Say it again. I don't know how much you've actually gone against Bernhardt out here, but from what you've seen from him, what do you think? Athletic guy. You, you look at him, you wouldn't really think, you know, he can he can move and all that. But he's definitely been putting on the show, been opening people's eyes, opening my eyes. So, um, like you said, I haven't really went against him a lot, but every time I see him, he's making a play. How, you know, you've been playing this game your whole life. He, took four years off to play lacrosse. How hard, if he ends up making this team, how difficult actually is that to pull off what he's done? Uh, I'm not in his shoes, but you know, I know it's an obstacle, but at the same time, uh, he's in this profession for a reason. You know, it's nothing that he can't handle. So he's um he's definitely been doing good. I just wasn't sure if it was something that you were like, wow, that. Yeah, yeah, it that is, is, it is, it is a wow. Um, before I knew him, I didn't know he had that, you know, in his history. But knowing that he um, was just playing lacrosse and just came out here, that's, that's a big jump. The Cinderella story of training camp was D. Alford and his kind of just rise up to, right. to now working with you guys in the first team, that nickel rotation. What mm -hmm. have you seen from him and his growth over the course of the last month? Uh, he's a gnat around the ball. You know, he always around the ball. Um, Athletic guy, you know, he's smart, he, even though he's short or whatever, but he's, he makes plays all the time. You really couldn't tell, if, you know, when he come down and tackle, you know, all, and just always around the ball, just a down-to-earth guy. When it comes to this secondary overall, what have you kind of learned about this group over the course of this preseason? Uh, you know, just, just trying to change the identity, trying to bring, like I always say, some swagger, um, just trying to have fun. And, uh, you know, everybody's been looking good getting to the ball well, making the right calls and uh, just playing fast. Do y'all feel, and I've maybe asked you this before, but it really does, <coughs> it really does feel like this group is close in a way that I don't know if I've seen a lot here. Yeah. How, why do you think that is? Like, why do you think that this group has come together the way it has? Uh, one, you know, we a young group. Mm -hmm. and then you got some vets, Casey, uh, Eric Harris and Dean. And I'm probably missing a few others, but we have a, a young secondary. So um, then you got the older guys coming that's been from different teams. So it's it's definitely been you know great for us, you know, just getting knowledge from the older guys and also us being younger guys eager to learn. So just things like that just help us play faster and bond. AJ, hey what have you seen from Isaiah over the course of this preseason? Obviously, it's kind of been a progression for him and. Talk to him after the game, talking yeah. about how DP's kind of drew up a blitz for him, yeah. like the same one that he got hurt on. How have yeah. you seen him kind of make that progression? Uh, he's been getting better every day. Um, now he's out his uh, his brace, and you can tell like he's moving more fluid, um, and he's just being a, a, a leader as well. You know, an older guy, and um, you know, he's a team player. You know, just one of those guys that you always can tip your hat to. And what could be the identity of the secondary with you got uh, Jalen and Rich kind of taking over, Casey and you know, Isaiah or D or however that works. What could be you all's identity for this season? Um, like I said, just make a plays. Um, that, that's what it all come down to when, the, when everything comes your way. You know, just make plays on the ball, always be around the ball, just lead and have the next play mentality.